Hey everyone! Today we want to have a look at reusing and rescuing components from projects that, let's say, didn't end so well. I guess everyone who's doing a bit of DIY has this box of shame with various projects that failed in it and yeah, one just doesn't want to look at them anymore. So let's get together all of our PCBs and see how we can reuse them and rescue the remaining components that would otherwise just go to waste or sit in this little box forever. So what I'm doing and using in order to get these components off the PCBs again and reuse them later on is to use a hot air station. There are like endless options of these available and they're not even too expensive. And the best thing is you don't even need like a super high-end one, a fairly cheap one for like 40 bucks will do. And yeah, let's head over to the workbench and get together our stuff. We need tweezers, a hot air gun and an old PCB. On this one we want to take off the TLO72 op amps. And for this we're gonna put the PCB down on our workbench, preferably on something that won't burn. And then we're gonna point the hot air gun on the chip. And as you see, it gets off very easily. I've sped up the footage so you don't have to look at me pointing the hot air gun at the chip for like 30 seconds. And yeah, make sure not to hold it down for like, I don't know, five minutes because that will probably cause the chip to not work. And as you see, it also works on through hole components like this jack, for example. And actually, since these through hole components can be quite expensive sometimes, like the, the pots, as you see here, it really saves you some money and they'll definitely be good enough for some prototyping. So thank you for watching. I hope this helped you. See you in the next video.